Uh, yo, I'm here with American Mech, and we are doing a podcast here in uh, August, towards the end of August. Now nah, it's like the middle-ish, uh, end-ish of August. It's like somewhere in the, on the something where with American Mech-ish on the 20th-ish-ish. So yeah, so let's go, Mech. Let's say it. Let's say it how it is. Let's do it how it is. Let's talk about how the Eagles just started their preseason, and they lost to the Chicago Bears, unfortunately, is what you were telling me. That's that's horrible, horrible news that they lost to Chicago. Fuck Chicago Bears. Uh, did you see? Did you end up seeing? Lost, but we're still not the most Yeah, did you see that game right now? What was the? Uh, was it pretty close, or was it? Or was it just like they got compl- the Eagles got completely destroyed? Mm, that was pretty close. It's like we had one more goal, we had a one. Oh shit! All right, well that's a that's that's good to hear. At least that we came pretty close to uh, in the scored range, and it wasn't a complete defeat. Uh, well, I can say good. The good news is that the Phillies won today. Earlier today, which was yesterday at this point, uh, thirteen to six against the Washington uh, team or whatever whatever the Washington team is called, um, they lost yesterday. Unfortunately, seven to six. They should have won yesterday too, but they're doing pretty good overall in terms of a uh, terms of the uh, draft pick or whatever it is. Um, looks like they could be. There's still a chance for the Phillies to go to the uh, to the uh, playoffs and to play at the uh, in the what we call it? not not the Super Bowl. It's the uh, whatever the what is it? What's for baseball? I'm I'm losing my mind, losing my words right now. For baseball, it's not the Super Bowl. What is it? It's the. Uh, Uh-oh. 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 <laughs> it's uh the um. The Super Bowl of baseball, they might make it this year. So, yeah, uh, that's what's up. Turner hit a couple a couple home runs today. Actually, this guy Turner, and uh, he was doing pretty bad. Every and uh, everybody on the in the Phillies crowd was cheering him on recently because how bad he was doing. So he would get up and they would cheer him, and I think that helped him get his motivation back. And now he's playing pretty good. And it looks like hopefully they're gonna start doing good again. Uh, see what happens with that. I'll keep you all. I'll keep you everybody here updated on what's going on with the Phillies and Mech. I expect you to keep us updated on the Eagles as well. Uh, when are they playing? When are the Eagles playing next? So they got a game coming up again. Do you know where? I believe it's twenty six. Yeah, twenty six. Alright. Wonder if they're yeah they they it's out with with football it's different it's like with baseball they play the Washington team like multiple times. They play the same team multiple times in a row. Whereas in football it's like each time they play they're playing a different team. So I don't know if they play somebody else next. Twenty four. I guess Colts. Cool. I forget where the Colts are from. Yeah, uh, Colts. Uh, hmm. I don't think they're Detroit. I don't remember. Uh, but yeah. So, uh, any any good players in the uh, any any good players that did some good stuff in the first game, like that stood out to you that you saw any fantastic plays or just how was that? Is anything anything stand out to you with their playing? Good defense, good offense. I thought it was good and everything. Cool. I can't remember the names, but yeah, it was pretty good. Alright. Yeah, so sports has been like something that's been interesting to me lately. I've been actually like getting into like making uh some designs for my website, like sports designs. I've made making like these finding these like cats with footballs and stuff and uh 
a couple a couple sports that you may or may might not have heard of, uh, which is both pickleball and cricket. Cricket. Have you ever heard of either of those sports in your life? Pickleball, yes. Yeah, I've been. I've actually been playing pickleball with a. Uh, with some people recently and it's a fun game man. it's pretty it's pretty easy to like learn and it's like way easier than tennis because you, you don't have to like run as much and uh it's a like it's a good community sport because you're like there's a lot of people that are into it it's like one of the fastest growing sports in the united states right now uh and every time i go to play uh which i've played a few times now it's been the whole pickle board, but the whole pickle ball courts have been packed with people, and uh, there's always people to play with whenever I go. It's just like random people. It's easy to easy to connect and like meet new people through the sport. Whereas tennis, I think it's uh, I don't know how tennis is, but I think pickleball is just a great community sport, and it's a lot of fun. Uh, you use two two paddles. They're like uh, like this big or so. With a little stick on them, and there's the paddle, and there's like this uh, wiffle ball type of ball. It's like a bright yellow wiffle ball, and basically you play like tennis, um, and you play to eleven points per game, and uh, so yeah, there's uh, all these different kind of trick shots and stuff. Like you want it when you hit the ball, you kind of want to spin it get a good spin on it if you can when you kind of like with the racket so that so when it gets to the other side the other the other person who hits it has a harder time hitting it and uh, there's serving which is like you got to serve the ball the right way and it has to go into the opposite court direction like there's a whole it's just it's a ton of fun and it was easy to learn because uh i don't have a whole bunch of sp- experience with like tennis but um it's just it's just cool. It's just fun. Uh, so this, that's what. And then cricket. You said you didn't hear about cricket before. Um, and cricket is like big in India and it's big in uh, Europe. It's like one of the biggest. Actually, it's the second biggest sport I think in the world after American football is cricket. Even though even though they don't really play it in the United States, like throughout the whole world, it's cricket is like the second biggest sport. And that's just basically, it's like baseball and it's like, it's not, it's actually completely different than baseball, but it's, it's set up like you're playing on like a baseball field. That's how it's similar. And you use this stick thing. It's like this, it's like this big stick and it's like long and it gets like thick here. And it's like a soft, like somebody, the pitcher holds like a softball and they throw it like underhand and you have to like swing at it and the difference is they don't use gloves; they use their hands. So a lot of people like break their fingers in the sport catching the ball because the pitcher or the hitter hits it so hard, and then they have to catch it, and sometimes uh, people get hurt. But um, it's crazy, wow. yeah. Uh, and like, uh, but I was, it can go on for the the games can go on for apparently weeks on end is what somebody told me. It's it's not like. It's not like the sports that we watch where the game can be done in a few hours. It's more like a game can go on for weeks at a time, apparently. And uh, I don't know if they play like multiple days or something. I don't know the whole gist of it, but it's it's kind of interesting. Uh, I was just like learning about that. And uh, I, I'm going to start watching it probably. And uh, I think I'll be a fan of India team versus being a fan of a Europe team myself because I like it. I like India. Um, do you like Indian food at all? Are you into Indian food? You ever have that? That's like, I think so. Uh, What'd you say? Right? Pizza? Yeah. That's like a tap. I think that's, uh, pizza is like American actually, if anything. Italian's more, I think it, I think um, Indian food's more like spicy. It's like chicken, curry. If you ever had like curry, or like uh, uh, this got some like cool like uh, vegetable dishes and stuff. I recommend you get some and try it out because I think you're gonna like it since you like spicy food. You're probably you'll probably become addicted to it actually if you try if you can get some Indian food at some point soon. Probably um, can. Yeah. 
Yeah, your favorite food, I think I think you said was tacos. Is that right? Yeah, still for this day. All right, weird. Um, been making any good taco dishes or anything lately? Uh, any, no. Yeah. Ugh. All right. Well, so how's uh how's the Florida how's Florida going and is the weather been okay out there and everything like what's going on in Florida in terms of uh weather and stuff? Mm-hmm. Same old shit, man. Yeah. 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 What kind of lifting you think you're gonna be doing? Some uh, arm stuff or leg stuff? Everything. <laughs> Heck yeah. Nice. What you uh? What's what can you lift? Do you do a bench press or anything like that? I'll let you know tomorrow. <laughs> yeah. I know. All right. I don't know what I can press anymore, but uh, you could probably. I, I bet. Why ain't fast? Nice. Yeah, that's a lot. I'm gonna try a bunch of and then just keep going. Yep. I think I think I think I can kind of max out at a hundred. So if you're starting at a hundred, that's kind of like where I could probably at this at this point in time, since I haven't lifted in a while, I'd be lucky to do a hundred if I could. Um, so, heck yeah, you got the ice cream sandwich. That's what's up. Oh man. I love the ice cream sandwiches, the traditional traditional ice cream uh, bar in the, uh, in the U.S. in general. So, so many, uh, I, like, I like the mint, there's like mint ice cream uh, sandwiches too. Those ones are pretty good if you ever had one. There's like uh, different flavors. It's like, you get like strawberry ones. Uh, but now the plain one is definitely the OP, the OP, like, traditional. I wonder if other countries are eating, eating like us and getting ice, these good ice cream bars. I bet they're not. I bet we have the best ice cream in the USA compared to every other country. Um, maybe, maybe not. Huh? Eh? Maybe, maybe not. Uh, I'm still want to go to my little period. Frozen yogurt. Here. Frozen yogurt. Best place on the planet. Best ice cream. Stop. Frozen ice cream. Yeah, frozen yogurt is, uh, I don't know, it's like the same as ice cream almost. I mean, it's, it's like, I guess it's a little different. Uh, yeah, there's frozen, uh, uh, there's frozen yogurt places here in the Pennsylvania. I've been to them, I don't know, like years back. And, like, it's kind of cool. You can, like, put all your favorite candies and toppings on when you go to those places and, like, whatever. Uh, so, yeah. I've been, uh... Chilling, making, I made, we made some, uh, pickle, I made some pickles recently of my own pickles, uh, by the way, which is pretty sweet. I was thinking about making some of those pickles that you had, those, uh, alcoholic pickles, but I was just, like, thinking, Wait, did you really? no, I didn't make any of them, because I, I figured it's just kind of stupid. Well, I mean, it's like, unless I use some cheap alcohol, I feel like it's a waste. I'd be, like, pouring it into, because if I make the pickles, I'm putting, like, a bunch of salt, water, I'm making it with like salty water and just like it'll like just basically a lot of the alcohol would be wasted I would assume I don't know how they make the ones that you had but I feel like a lot of it would just go to, it's like it's kind of a wasteful of the uh alcohol which is uh we got to conserve our alcohol you know 
<laughs> so, <laughs> I'll just take I'll just take a shot and then eat a pickle while I'm taking a shot is what I figure instead of instead of pouring it in and uh, doing it that way. <laughs> I don't know. I don't want to take whiskey pickles. I can't, I don't know, man. I don't know why I've not. Seen a of those. Oh, you have nice. I've never seen uh, any of the any of that type of stuff. I still have to check if my local liquor liquor store has any of those pickle pickle uh, vodka things that you had. But uh, I don't know. That might be a Florida thing. Did you ever see those when you were in Pennsylvania? No. Hmm. Could be a Florida thing then. I mean, all I see is a big shot of pickle whiskey. Pickles that still. Mm hmm. So, uh. Hmm. Yeah. Now I like pickles. Oh, yeah. Heck yeah. Pickles, pickles, pickles. And. And, uh. Peppers, hot peppers. <laughs> Let's go. So, pickles and ice cream. Mex going for some pickles right now after ice cream. That's the uh, that's the move. I, I brought him up, and now he wants them. <laughs> and now I kind of want some too. But I'm not gonna get up and ditch everybody here and leave this podcast with nobody, nobody uh, talking or entertaining as we entertain everybody out here on the pedal to the metal podcast i'm chadwick that's american mech we started last september with this podcast we've been going at it it's almost been a year and we're still making entertainment to the max so what kind of pickles do you have just plain pickles Oh, nice. I like sliced ones. Yeah, I like how you can like get ones that are sliced and you can get ones that are whole. It's like different different textures to them and how they're cut and they're just like different ways of eating them and uh, and they're healthy too. That's the good thing about pickles is they're super they're super healthy um, for us as we build our muscles up and we do our workouts and stuff. We'll eat our pickles. And become pickle people, just like the word pick. I don't know why the game, I was talking about pickleball with the tennis game. I don't know why it's called pickleball. There's nothing to do with pickles in it. But I, I absolutely, we all like pickles. So yeah, it's like, I guess, you know what it is? You just showed that pickle. It kind of looks like the bat kind of, maybe that, that pickle you have kind of looks a little bit like the, uh, like the racket I use almost. <laughs> That could be the reason. So. <coughs> hmm. Well. Yeah, if you want to. Um, I mean, I think we added a lot of value to everybody in entertainment. So, uh, you want to close this out here? Yeah, sure. All right. Uh, Yeah. Yeah, enjoy everybody. Peace.